For some people, arms are the most important body part to train. That's why you see most people at the gym doing curls and cable pushdowns. Those exercises are a great way to develop big arm muscles. However, some people don't have the time or money to invest in a gym membership. Well, we got good news. You can work your arms at home almost as effectively as you can in a gym. That's why today, in the second episode of Build It With Science, we will talk about some ways and exercises to build big arms at home. The first triceps exercise is quite a great one. It doesn't have a name, but we will just call it the amazing bodyweight tricep exercise. To perform this one you need two solid chairs. You place the chairs as you can see in the graphics. Place your right hand on the right edge of the chair, and the left one on the left edge of the chair. Place your heels on the other chair. The chairs must be facing each other one meter apart. Now, go down slowly and push explosively. Be careful though, don't go too low and hurt yourself, stop when you feel like your triceps are completely stretched. Also, take it easy if you're just starting out. Second exercise for your triceps is the bodyweight dips. You can perform them on parallel bars if you have them, and if you don't you can always use two chairs. Put two chairs each one on one side of your body, and use them as dip bars. You want to bend your knees and start going up and down slowly. Take a deep breath when going down and exhale when pushing up. Make sure your knees don't touch the floor, or else there will be no tension on the muscles worked. Just make sure to keep your body slightly upright to target the triceps more than the pec. The exercise for the triceps is push-ups. Regular push-ups already target the triceps, but to target your triceps more when performing push-ups you need to keep your elbows and arms close to your body, keep them tight to the point where they're stuck to your sides. The graphics explain it better as you can see. To perform them you have to go down slowly and push your body up explosively. This variation of push-ups can be extremely hard if you're a beginner, since you're pushing your whole weight up using only the triceps, but once you're strong enough to perform them, you'll notice amazing results. Three exercises should be more than enough to build a strong foundation and develop a respectable amount of strength. Now that we're done talking about the triceps, let's jump straight to the biceps. We will also mention three exercises to build and develop them. The exercise is, of course, chin-ups, but if you don't have a pull-up bar at home just wait for the second exercise we'll mention because you'll be surprised. Anyway, regular chin-ups are great for overall bicep development and strength. To perform them you need nothing but your body and a pull-up bar installed at home. You should have your palms facing your body shoulder width apart. Make sure to use the full range of motion and pull yourself up fast, but lee your body go slowly down. Always make the positive part of the movement faster than the negative part of the movement. Chin-ups are great for overall biceps, forearms, and back development. The second exercise is also chin-ups, but simpler and easier. To perform them you need three chairs and a strong broomstick. Use the chairs as support for the broomstick as you can see in the graphics. Your palms should be facing your body shoulder width apart just like a regular chin-up. Place your heels on the third chair, and now just simply perform a chin-up. This variation is better for beginners and people who don't have access to a pull-up bar. Just make sure the chairs and the stick are strong enough to support your weight, or else you might fall and hurt yourself. Or creative and needs a good mind-muscle connection. And the best part about it is it works both your triceps and your biceps. You need only a towel for this one. Explaining it verbally is hard, we'll try, but the graphics explain it better. Grab the towel with your right hand, and let its edges hang from the sides. Grab the edges with your left hand, and now you want to pull the towel using your left triceps to create resistance, and at the same time, you want to pull using the right biceps. This way, you're working both your triceps and biceps. Repeat the same process with the left hand. You need to have a strong mind-muscle connection for this exercise for it to be effective. In conclusion, the arm is the part of the limb between the shoulder joint and the elbow. The triceps are bigger than the biceps, giving the triceps more attention may result in developing bigger arms. You can work your arms at home, you just have to be a little creative. The exercises we mentioned are more than great to develop a strong foundation for your arm muscles.